matter in its classification. As we all know, matter is defined as anything that has mass and occupies space. We can ma classify matter a hard to way, in either physical or chemical. Physical classification of matter is according to its space. while chemical is according to its composition. Under physical, it may classify matter either rigid or fluid. So rigid, meaning unbending, or inflexible, While fluid is a substance that flows. Rigid matter are usually solid, which maintains its shape when subjected to outside force, while liquid and gas are fluid, which occupies the space of its container. Under chemical means, or according to its composition, matter can be pure substance or mixture. A pure substance or cannot be separated by physical means, while mixture can be separated by physical means. Pure substance fall either compound or element. An element is a type of matter that cannot be broken down into two or more pure substances by breaking bonds. There are 118 known elements, as we can see in periodic table wherein 91 of it occur naturally. It is identified by its symbol. Elements can be classified according to its valence electrons, either metal, metalloid, or non-metal. While compound is a substance, is a pure substance that can be broken down into two or more elements by chemical means. Compounds have fixed composition. That is, a given compound always contains the same element in the same percentage by mass. While mixture can fall in the two category, either heterogeneous mixture or homogeneous mixture. By the way, excuse for the dash in between compound, heterogeneous, and homogeneous. That's just a typographical error. Back to the discussion. Homogeneous com mixture, or sometimes called solution, has a uniform mixture, are one in which the composition is the same throughout, which is made up of a solvent, most, mo most commonly a liquid, but solid homogeneous are alloys. So homogeneous mixture has uniform mixture. While heterogeneous are non-uniform mixture are those in which the composition varies throughout. Most rocks fall into this category like granite. Its part can be easily separated through different methods such as filtration, distillation, and etc.